Building Science has traveled to Adairsville, Georgia, visiting Yanmar. Today we look at the science behind one of the most progressive solutions on the market for your home or building. This is Building Science. Combined Heat and Power Units, or CHP, is the use of a single fuel source, like propane, to simultaneously generate electricity and useful heat. CHPs are used to power such applications as light commercial, multifamily, and residential. Economic savings, environmental impacts, and energy independence are just a few of the advantages. But how does this compact and seemingly quiet unit power and heat an entire facility? Well, it's interesting you asked about building science and how it relates to CHP, because I sit there and I think, okay, well, CHP, some are going to look at it as, well, it's a tan box. And it's an interesting tan box because it's got a, a ton of technology in it. It's got a reciprocating engine, it's got electronics, it's got hot water and things, and it's designed to improve the performance of buildings. Tell me about the CHP. Explain it to, to somebody who's just hearing about the combined heat and power systems for the first time. Okay, so a CHP unit can be thought of basically as an engine that's powering a generator to produce electricity for your building. But in addition to that, you're also gonna take advantage of the waste heat from that engine. So for example, you're gonna use the electricity produced to power your building, and then the waste heat could be used to heat your water or perhaps even heat the occupied space. So you say the technology's been around for 30 years. They've used this in other parts of the world, and you guys have brought it here. What for? CHP is, is a very old technology, but Yanmar scaled it down to a size where it can be easily integrated into smaller buildings, homes, like commercial buildings. Well, it's very cutting edge because typically when people think of going off the grid, they look at photovoltaics, they look at generation systems, traditional generators. And what makes this very different is that you're able to capture the waste heat from the engine, which is what makes much higher efficiency than using PV or using a traditional generator. So one of the modifications or changes that you guys made in this engine is this unit, this unit right here. Yes. So this is not on a normal diesel engine. Yes, that's right. And what does this do? Uh, this is a heat, exhaust gas heat exchanger, uh, cooling water capture the heat from exhaust gas, then supply to facility. So this, this little unit right here yes. can supply hot water yes. to a home, to a business, that's, that's incredible. Yeah. Even as an engineer, even with, the, with, with your mind and your understanding of this, of the science behind it, what was surprising to you? Uh, the first thing was pretty basic and that was the size of the unit. Uh, I looked at its BTU output and for a propane powered unit of about 65,000 BTUs per hour, I had expected the unit to possibly have a bigger engine, to be larger in size. Understanding the true benefits of a CHP unit makes more sense if you understand the conventional power generation techniques and systems that are in place today. It's very easy to understand how taking fuel like propane and converting it into heat energy and electricity for the benefit of a, of a homeowner or for a business to help them save money and to help uh, lower their operating costs or their home costs, that's exciting. Well, what makes it so easy for anyone to understand is that it's an all-in-one unit. Uh, you don't have to worry about uh, bringing on external systems, uh, external coils and pumps, and figuring out uh, how the engine's going to be moved or placed. The entire thing is self-contained. In addition to that, you can also have a remote monitoring system, which we use, which is basically a small screen where you can set your schedule, see how it's operating, what the output is, everything you need from a screen inside the building, so you don't even need to ever go outside and look at it or even tinker with it at all. When you are able to capture 100% of the heat output of a CHP, you are essentially maximizing efficiency in the machine because the electricity that it generates is actually free. CHP, it has a payback. It's actually an investment because it has a payback and unlike a, a standby generator set, which is a sunk cost, CHP produces revenue after your payback period. So it actually makes you money, not just save you money. This is how you power your entire data center? That is correct. It's the primary power, not backup power. So the confidence level you have in that is 100%? 100%. That's why it's primary. 
The technology and forward thinking of turning propane into on-site power and heat generation has given homeowners, builders, and facility managers confidence in continuous power, lowered energy consumption, and most importantly, cost savings. Now that you know how CHP works and the uniqueness of this technology, we look at how this system is integrated into homes and businesses across the globe. For Building Science, I'm Adam Grubb.